today we are talking with the amazing color guru, Jill Kirsch. So we have Jess as our the first lovely mom. Jess, yes. yes. And you're, this is, she is actually a great um, representation of what a lot of Latinas look like with their hair colored, mm -hmm. bleached, uh, blonde. So what would her color be? Or well, color palette. Right. I'm glad you said color yes. palette because she can wear a ton of colors, but say different ones than me or someone else. So let's take a look. All right. So purple is like a very trendy color right now. All right. So let's just start with that. Okay. So this purple is a royal purple. Okay. And then we have this one. This is more of like an orchid kind of color. I love that. Yeah. Nice. Let's see if we can do any better. This one is more of a lavender. And this one is like, um, what do I call it? Aubergine or an eggplant color. Oh my gosh, that's so good. That yes. is so that is good on you. Because the whole idea here is you want the attention of the viewer to be drawn from the color to the face to the hair. So all the arrows are pointing up. So just check that out. Look at this. Plus, I mean, you have a really good jawline anyway but it's really good here. Now look at the difference. And it's not like if you like a color or not, it's really what the color does for you. Watch the difference. It's between... about the color liking you. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Look at the difference between that presentation. Now watch. No. Do you see? It totally washes just, her out. Yes. And it conflicts with all the warmth that's in here. So it looks like dyed, whether it is or not, we don't care, but it looks dyed because it's not balanced with what you're wearing. here. Bam, beautiful. So much better, okay? This one, this one is a little bit warmer, but to me, it's kinda muddy. Do you know what I it mean? It doesn't pop. No, it totally doesn't pop. She's We're, not the star. She's not the star, yes. that she is, yes. but she's not, right? Visually. Now she's the star. Now she's, now the, she's star. the star. You see the difference, right? Yes. You see it? Now watch. See, it's just very yes. muddy. It's yes. almost, for Oops. me, like a camera that's yes. out of focus a yes. little bit. It's not a sharp, fresh picture. And this one, um, it's not bad. I think it's a little bright. I think it just pulls the attention just to the color. It's not the best no. on her. Whereas here, amazing. Awesome. Awesome. I love it. So this, And what about the color she's wearing now? I told green? her originally, this is a really good color on her. I call your hair like it's like a deep honey blonde. You know, so the category, the color palette I would put you in is called deep honey blondes, golden browns, and redheads. Okay, I'm going to show it to you. Um, so these are your colors, which means every single shade in here is good for you. Let's see. Ooh, I love those. All of these colors, oh, these are amazing on you. Every single shade works Beautiful. for you. Beautiful. Right? See, From so the it's light like, to the dark. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And you don't just get one brown, just say. There are a yes. few. You know what I mean? Everything works. I want to show you something because this is very cool. Hold that up for me for a second. Okay. Check out a fashion don't. <laughs> okay. This is what you don't want to do. Don't. Oh, yeah. No. Totally washes you out. Makes you It's look not gray. attractive, people. It's, it's so not. not attractive. So And see how it just conflicts with everything? Whereas here, everything is in sync and we didn't put any yes. makeup on at all so then yes. all you do with the makeup is take the colors in here which I've done in these makeup kits um, take the colors that are in here and pull it up to the face you know in the for the eyes cheeks and the lips I love these colors on you your hair looks yes. amazing in these colors and also, it's interesting that even without her having makeup on yeah the colors warm her face totally she doesn't need makeup no no it, that's the whole thing it's yeah. so fun and the makeup just takes it further also, since I have you sitting here, for metal, okay, this is a really good tip, gold versus silver. This is a gold girl. Now look at the difference. As she's like cringing, like, oh my God, I only wear silver. Is I that know, that's that really true? funny that I you so said that. that up. <laughs> okay, look at that. Yes. Now look at this. Not so good. No. So much better. Not, and no. it's so funny because I say like like this looks kind of dull and brassy. Like these are really cheap little chains, but look but at the difference. Work. This looks yeah. so much richer. Versus yeah, that, works. which means once you know your colors, you don't have to spend a lot of money. Mm -hmm. You don't have to waste a lot of time on you know the wrong thing. These and are the awesome same on with accessories. Totally. Now let let's talk because uh, we're doing um, we're doing solid colors. But let's say she wants to wear plaids or she wants to wear uh, paisley or mm -hmm. 
or uh, you know a print how would she know what her color is well I mean as long as the overall effect is in this group okay it's gonna be fine because what I've done with these colors I don't know if we can see them is that not only are all these your colors but every color coordinates with each other do you see what I mean yes. so you can like mix this with this yes you know with oh, this okay with this so everything works together so say you have a print and every single shade isn't in here but the overall effect mm -hmm. is in here go for it that makes sense yeah yeah it's awesome Cool. Excellent. So when you go on stage, yes. Uh, for those of you watching, Jess is a musician and a singer, so she's on stage a lot. So these colors, her knowing totally. her colors, totally helps her with her performance. You know, and as artists, we want to know what our best colors are. Right. So when we are out there in the public, we look fabulous. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And that's why I did these swatch books. So this. Is what my clients don't leave home without. This is a swatch book, okay? And it has all of Jess's colors in here, okay? And what you do is you take this shopping and you go to the store and you match up the colors. Like, look at this dress. You so nailed it oh, before yeah. I even came, right? <laughs> but see, it's like right in here, you know? And if you work within here, all the colors work with each other and they all work with you. And what's great about those swatches, because I have it, I've had it for the last How many years? seven years. Long time. I swear by the, that little book. I swear by <laughs> it. I take it with me every time I think I want to buy something. I will take it with me. And if it doesn't match, I leave it alone because I like all kind of colors. And so that keeps me honest. <laughs> you know? Well, look at this. Yeah. I mean, look at this. Keeps like, what is it? A picture? This is a, worth a thousand words. tutorial. Jill I taught me it. how to wear the right colors. <laughs> colors, colors, it. colors. We wear the right colors, people. Yeah, so, it's great. It's excellent. really great. Excellent. So thank you so thank much. Thank you. you too. Being awesome. 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 Model. awesome. Beautiful. So now we have at our chair, Ooh. Sandy Brown. <gasps> the the one, Sandy Brown. The only <laughs> extravaganza girl. Or color Sandy extravaganza. Brown. There you go. <laughs> so, colors, colors, colors. She's a black haired girl. She is. I didn't say black girl, today. I said black hair girl. Today. That's right. That's right. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jill, she's a comedian. We love her so much. <laughs> Okay, well, she's gorgeous. She's gorgeous. And we're going to make her look amazingly even better. Yes. yes. Amazingly even better. Yes. That sounds so Amplify. If we're we're going to amplify. We're going <laughs> to kick it out of the She's going to rock her star <laughs> with her colors. I've been wanting to know my color palette since I saw Lydia rock hers years ago. And she goes, oh, I know, I know my colors. And I'm like... <laughs> In her in inimitable <laughs> way of saying it, I'm sure. Got I know my, all my colors. Got my little swatches. Let me go and everywhere her swatches. With it. <laughs> all right, so you are now going to enter the world of color. Ooh. May you never be the same again. Ooh, it's cozy. Okay. It's not, okay. The water's nice. Okay, here Get we go. Get ready. <laughs> Pop your cherry, girl, with the color. Woo! Go, go, go. Okay, here we go. So here's here's some of the blues. Okay, so you have that blue, which is more of like a turquoisey blue, and then we have this one which is a teal. Mm -hmm. We're going to talk about some other stuff with you because we're talking about hair color There'll and changes and talk. all that. There'll be there will talk. There'll be talk. Definitely. Yes. Talk. There'll be lots oh, of talk. Yes. Okay. Yes. This one <laughs> is a really dusty blue. Dusty. And this, my friends, hmm. is the money shot. Look at this color on her. Shazam! Whoa! Oh, now! Oh, yeah. Go. Okay, Love it. Do you wear it? Gorgeous. Yes. So is this is lapis or is it a lapis? Um, it's, royal. It's, oh, cobalt? Cobalt, okay. Mm. Okay, so now look at the difference between that. See that against the, this is like a very dark brown black hair. Yeah? Yes. Like dark, okay, now look at the difference between that. Now watch. Total washout. Yes. Total not, washout. Not flat. Mm. It not as like pizzao, you know? It's yeah, very it's, ghetto, not fabulous. <laughs> Ghetto unfabulous. Yeah. Ghetto unfabulous. I love it. Infab infabulous. Yes, infabulous. Yeah, and, and it's so interesting because we didn't obviously do it's any very changes fail. in makeup. It's very fail. Okay, <laughs> that's fail. I have things this color too, and I'm, I always look at. It, I'm like, you look so cute on the rack. Right, right. How, you do this? How many people? <laughs> and do any of them still have their tags on them in the closet? I've worn yes. them, but I've, but I've had pictures. Can you take the tag off now? Yeah. <laughs> oh, hmm. Okay, look at this. Return. I cannot tell you enough 
how important this is for headshots because I was just informed that mm. a vast part of Miss Lydia's audience um, are, are actors. performers, That's actors, right. singers, That's you know. That's right. This, knowing your colors for headshots is like amazing. Headshots and auditions, also for branding. Yes. Especially online branding, especially when you're building websites. Mm -hmm. You know, I've seen people's websites where there's so much going on and so many colors and no theme and no nothing that you kind of have to find the person. Or you know what I mean? they take somebody else's color palette. Oh, they yeah. They like the pinks or they like a certain color that they saw on something else, but it doesn't represent Exactly, them. exactly. Like right now, I notice a lot of websites have like a soft pinkish you know really? like a like a, a muted pink or a, a nude pink and it's pretty but it's not it doesn't necessarily it doesn't favor them. yeah yeah represent them and mm. so what you want to do is surround yourself between the backgrounds and the fonts <laughs> and all of that stuff with color that's going to enhance you you know, as a performer, it's all about beautiful. You, I've you know, been and drawn that's a to great this color. color it's fascinating. You. I've been drawn to this color. I got a car in this color. It's like I oh, want fantastic. everything. Oh, fantastic! The cup fantastic. in my car. It's like I'm <laughs> soaking up this color. And this one is just too heavy. You look older in this color. Mm. Do you know what I mean? You kind of sink into the color, and this one is just way too bright. I, it's like I, I, I said it before, but it's like I can't find you in the color. The color is so it's, it's dominant. about the color. But I have to show you. Look at how fabulous this is. Look at. And then it pops again. It comes and back to her, her face. beautiful wow. face. You know, it's like amazing. And see the hair on the color. Yes. It's just it's, it's just a really good balance. I did a workshop yesterday. Oh my God, so much in like four days for actors. This is a true story. And I was in the hallway getting ready to go in, and I see an actress <laughs> wearing a black jacket and this color blouse. And it was her color. And I just had to say something because she just looked so amazing. This, I swear this is a true story. And she said, I know I have your swatch book. Oh, I didn't even know. I didn't even know that she had the thing. And it just drew my mm -hmm. eye to her because she was so present. You know, just the visual. Just the visual. Before so, she even speaks. Exactly. Exactly. And that's what you want. You and need. you know what? People of color a lot of times tend to be about color. Like, you know, if you're Latina or you're black, you tend to like a lot of color. So it's important to know that you're using the right colors because they can knock you out. If yeah. You know. Look at this. These are your colors. Miss mm -hmm. Sandy Brown, mm -hmm. look at this. Oh, my God. These are so mm -hmm. awesome. Look at my palette. Delicious. This is your palette. <laughs> Delicious. So good. Every single shade look in here that. works for you. Every single one I'm digging it. is really good. Someone was talking to me about branding yesterday, about for her Instagram, mm -hmm. and using all her colors mm -hmm. for all the stuff. Yes. You know, like to brand yourself and stuff. It's, it's, it's great. It's that specific. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Now, I'll show you a fashion don't, mm -hmm. because I want you to see. Here. Well, here. Let's look at this one. This was so good on our two lovely earlier models. Watch this. No. No. It's so flat. It makes Nuts. skin tone more yellow. You just melt me into the color, whereas here... Shade of color. Yes. No change in makeup, no change in anything. Gorgeous. Awesome. Now, also, we were talking about changing your hair color because you do yes. that. Yes. You do different hair, yes. like yeah. wigs and extensions Absolutely. or whatever. So that's where you use this to make another hair color work. That's why mm. it's so much fun. It's not like you ah. are these colors and you can never veer, you know. If you change your hair color drastically, like if you became, like right now, mm. like um, Jess, like that honey blonde, mm -hmm. then the colors would change up. Wow. You know? But know what those colors are to be most effective. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Like these are great. These are um, these are so good. Also, I was saying, these are the colors, I don't know, maybe later we'll show makeup kits yes. or whatever. Yes, but um, I'm all about the color for the eyes, cheeks, and lips. And that's what I've coordinated based entirely on all of my color palettes. But I will tell you now, for foundation, Skin tone rules. You absolutely get a foundation that blends into your skin tone. You know, that's where the skin tone comes in, 100%. But for the eyes, cheeks, and lips, it's all about the hair. The redheads, the blondes, gray hair, um, reddish brown hair. And what if you're bald? Mm. Then how do we rock color? Okay, so if you're bald, bald. you have eyebrow color, mm -hmm. right? You have, I mean, I just had a client yesterday who was, but he had like that scruff thing, and mm -hmm. I could tell. 
I mean, I've been doing this for a long time. <laughs> I could tell by his skin tone. Yes. It, it did come into play. Um, but also the hair on his face, you know. Um, also, when I've done one-on-one sessions, especially with actors, like one gal hired me to find out what's her best hair color. That's why she wow. booked me. And when I got to her house, she had on, it's true, on their couch, 8 by 10s this is a few years ago when people were actually printing 8 by 10s on the couch. Literally, her hair color was different, like every wow. palette. Yeah. She was once a platinum blonde. Wow. She was once this, she was once that. Plus I have clients that work with wigs and stuff. Mm-hmm. So what I did then with her was I pulled back her hair because that's why she wanted to know what her best hair color was. And we found her best hair color. Nice. Wow. You know? that's but, but now it's like, it's so, I've made this so simple that when you know your hair color, I've put mm. all the colors together for clothing and for makeup. Okay, so there's the gold. Not so good. And there's the silver. Oh my goodness. It's so crisp, right? Yes, it is. Yes, it Beautiful. is. It's amazing. It works with your hair color, it works with the colors. Yes, yes. Right? The gold, not so much. You use this concept for everything nail color, um, mm-hmm. sunglasses, reading glasses. I mean, oh, just wow. everything. Accessories, and everything. Accessories t shirts, every all Starves. of it. Jewelry. You know, like stones, different stones are in the palette. You know, like and for these, men that would be ties. For a They're guy, tie. the tie yeah. is like the makeup for a woman. Okay. The tie is like right here. So you don't want to walk into an interview, an audition, or whatever, mm-hmm. and have the whole thing be about how interesting the tie mm-hmm. is, or how that tie doesn't work with anything, or it's a distraction. Mm-hmm. You don't want that. You want, you want the attention of the viewer to be drawn up to you and truly for me the whole thing with this is once everything is in sync the message that you're communicating rides on that wave wow do you know what I mean Mm -hmm. it's like the eye of the viewer goes from the color to the color to the cheeks to the eyes to the hair and then the message you're saying in words just gets right out there Mm -hmm. instead of like the viewer having to get through like so many distractions to get you to get your message like you walk in you own the room it's like Mm -hmm. everything is working together Mm -hmm. and truly you can't blow it you can't make a mistake because I put it together (laughs) I mean I know I I picked the best of the best of every shade for the makeup colors and for the swatch book and then you don't have to think about it anymore excellent Okay, so before so Sandy thrilled. leaves, I want to bring in Bethany and I want to bring in Lexi because they they all have black hair, yes. but they have different skin tones. Yes, and let's so see if, if I think if I can um, yeah, show you. So we have uh, so we are now covering <laughs> the Latinas with black hair. So this is the range of yeah, dark skin brown tones or black hair. Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. And we all will wear the same color palette. We all will have the same color palette yes. as Sandy. Yes. All right. Great. Okay. Yes. Should we pass it around? Yeah. yeah. Let's pass it around. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Look at that. Look at awesome. that. The pinks, the blues, Amazing. the royal purples. Great. Beautiful. All right. Okay. So I'll have you step out, yeah. and then I'll bring Bethany. Uh, no, I think. So oh, look yeah. at that. Look at that. Look at that color. Do you wear any Beautiful. of those colors? Um, actually, I'm pretty much a shades of gray kind of person. Gray Blacks and good. grays, but gray I've been wanting good. to add color, so like this really works. Like, they work really well. Awesome. Really well. Awesome. Great. Awesome. All right. So I want to let you step out. So you should know. <laughs> that if you have black hair, yeah. these are your colors. Yep, They're all for your sure. colors. You can wear. You can be as bold as you want to be. And you'll see that there are some light colors in here too, but they're really icy colors, like an ice yellow, an ice pink, an ice blue. And what you do with those? They're not to, pastel. No, that's exactly what I was yeah, going to say. Yeah. They're not this like dusty kind of color. Do you know what I mean? They're much clearer colors. And as one tip for the dark hair, like the dark brown or black hair, when you do these light colors, put them next to a stronger color and it's going to pop it more. So like if instead of wearing just like a pink blouse like that, if you put it next to like a navy top or a charcoal gray jacket, Ooh, the contrast nice. is really good. It's really good. Nice. All yeah. right. Thank you, Sandy Brown. Thank you. So we have Ruthie Otero with us right now. 
and Jill is going to do her colors. Well, the interesting thing I thought was when Jill first came in, she said that Ruthie and Jess were of the same color palette. Hmm. I got confused. So explain it to me. It happens. <laughs> I got confused. Okay. So the color palette that Jeff's was in is for deep honey blondes, which is what Jess is, golden browns, mm -hmm. and redheads, okay? And mm -hmm. you have like an auburny, like a red oh. thing going on in the mm -hmm. hair, and it's very warm. Mm -hmm. So it's not like one palette is just for one hair color group, oh. you know? Um, but we're going to show you. You don't have to believe any of this. We have to show you what a difference color makes. So what, what color you want to try? Well, my favorite color is red. Okay, so we're going to try some red. All right, so here's a red. 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 Okay. Okay, so this red is like a rose red. red. Rose red. A rose red. It's like a blue rose red. red. Okay, not now so check good. this one out. Rose red. What? What's not so, so good? good. Not, not so good. good. No? I don't think it's good yeah, either. Not, not, mm, not, okay. it's not happy red. But look at this. Oh, oh my, my gosh, God. poppy red. God. It's so good. It's, <laughs> it's so good. I want you to see red. how all these gorgeous. highlights in her hair, which she probably pays a fortune for. Beautiful. Right. Only a fortune. Oh, start coming <laughs> out. Do you know what I mean? You start being drawn to them because mm. it's in sync with the hair color. Mm. Oh. And the face, it's, it's beautiful. Now look at the difference between that and watch. Wow. No. Yeah, and I even feel it like energetically. Yeah, I feel much happier with that. That's one. so interesting. Yeah, and that's like a favorite. And of this kind of grays too. you. This kind of yeah, you okay. definitely can use your colors like for for nail color. But look, look at the difference. Wow. So if you want to look sickly, exactly. And if you want to look hot and vivid and younger and brighter and healthier, look at that. So, so what if you're is, going for a hot Latina, this is the color. See. This is the red. And what is this called? Totally. Um, this is a very orangey red. Orangey it's like red. a poppy red. Right. You know? Now look at the difference. Now if you're going to totally go grazed, for a, a older frumpy yeah. character, mm -hmm. not so well off, yeah. no pop. That's the um, and that's the and if in the over the arc of a story, of a script, if you're doing like really well, you know what mm. I mean, and you're looking good, and you got the job, and the guy, and the thing, mm. and the whatever, mm. you know, you can extend the character with color. Yes. But over the arc of the story, oh, okay. if you're not doing so well, or you get job, ill, or you lose poorly. the job, or whatever, you can extend the character with mm. the wrong color. Especially, and I did this as an actor um, many times, when you're doing these um, low budget, no budget, deferred payment for like for we don't even know how long, or just trying to build never a reel, get that money. Um, you can use this concept to get some really good tape on yourself. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? When you know, when they have no money for makeup or wardrobe or any of that, if you know this whole thing, um, you can get some really great nice. Tape. Okay. Okay, so let's try something else. Let's try another color. I pulled some blues out Ooh. here. Okay, and let's just see what happens. Okay, so this blue is more of like a turquoise kind of blue. I feel like a nurse. This one, <laughs> this one is the royal blue. And again, I go mm. back to saying that this isn't only about colors that you like. Okay, because mm. sometimes aesthetically you can like a color, yeah. but it doesn't like you as much as something else. Mm. So you, let's open, what is it, think outside the box, your yes. color box, right? This is more of a dusty blue, and this is what I call a teal, so it's a much greener blue. Okay. Oh, I love mm. that, do you wear that color? That's Gorgeous. a great color on you. I like this Gorgeous. color, I don't wear it a lot. It's a really good color on but you. But I'm attracted to this Gorgeous. color. Now let's see the really? difference between mm -hmm. this versus not so much. No, totally so washes like, you out, and it, okay. it takes away from all the warmth It's like hair. a a low level nurse. Yes. Low level. Yeah, low level. Low level. Not even a surgeon. <laughs> <laughs> Not even an operating room nurse. Not We're that they're low level <laughs> nurses. We're just talking <laughs> casting. Right. Yes. Casting. So this is all about casting. All about, all about casting. A nursing student, maybe. Yes. Who's struggling? A poor <laughs> struggling <laughs> nursing student. <laughs> Okay, but look at this. I love nice. this. Really? Versus that. Yes. This huh. one, I think it's too strong. I was going to say. This is all about the blue. Mm -hmm. It's all about the base. Mm -hmm. It's all about the blue. It's all so, and blue. you know, okay, so for actors, um, a lot of times for commercial auditions, oh, yeah. and you would know, like, they say, wear bright colors. Wear yes. bright colors, okay? My viewpoint is I want the actor to look bright in the color. Yes. Amen. So here, I'm looking you at want that color. Pop, a bright color. Yes. Mm. But it's not popping you. I'm not popping. No. Right. But the color's here, popping. check this out. That'll pop you. Really? 
there I yes. see your face more. Yes. Your hair color. Oh. Everything yes. is like aligned versus that. And this one is just too bright. It's way too bright. It's a bit distracting. Mm. You know, yeah. So it's, it's also all about, about the color. that color. It's okay. and you're, it's like you're in a color versus wearing it. And mm -hmm. also, you get a much again a much better line, which is so good for camera. A jawline with this color huh. versus beautiful that one. It's very ah. flat. It's very oh, okay. flat. Okay. Okay. So let's take a look at this whole palette, the whole range. Okay. So here's the range of color. So all of these colors, gorgeous. It's really good. Yes. See your hair mm -hmm. folds yes. right into this. Do you right. see that? And okay. even though her and Jess have different exactly. hair color, the same colors yep. work on both of them. Beautiful. Oh. I love it. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Beautiful. And, and also gold. Called? Gold? Gold is really? much better. These yes. Are warm drop tones. It? This is the warm tones. Yes. Yes. This is good for redheads. It's good for um, golden browns. And, and it's the, good for like gold. I like it. Felt. I'm happy Blondes. looking at these colors. Yes. Oh, look. Okay. Yes. Gold. We well, yeah, let's see. You tell oh, me what you, colors. Look at that. Yes. The so gold much better. is awesome. Okay. So much better. I like silver too. The silver yes. doesn't gold. work. Gold. You're a golden right. child. Golden, golden child. Gold. And then I have a question though. Yes. When I go shopping, yeah. am I looking for the exact because I can be this way, looking for the exact color? <laughs> no, it has to be that color. Okay, so what How I do tell I know? my clients is we need not obsess. No. Okay. okay. I'll try not <laughs> to. Try not to obsess. <laughs> we want to get as close as you can. That's why you take the, you know, the booklet, this. which is right over here. Conveniently, um, you take it with you. So if it's not exactly, exactly, but it's right in, in here, this family. go for it. Because I'll show you the difference. I mean, look, you take this one, it's totally on the other side of town. Oh my God, that's a different world. So that's Although I like some of those colors. But they're like, not your colors. All right, see, because that one, your, uh, this, 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 wouldn't, this wouldn't work for me. None no. of those colors Oh man, I have colors. to redo my <laughs> What did you say? <laughs> there, there. None of these are your colors. No. I need a height. Nada. Nada. <laughs> look, hold it up. Hold it up to your face. Okay, now look. Okay. Wow. Oh, you it's like tell the difference. totally different communication. Now look. All Bam. washes you out. No, it's horrible with the hair. It just doesn't Get work. Get rid of it. <laughs> totally. <laughs> totally. Get to, to embrace know. your colors. These are your yes. colors. Get to know them. This Get is to them. them. Yes. yes. They're all your colors. Every single one of those is in here. Everyone needs awesome. to purchase a swatch <laughs> book so you could take it with you so that you can be the superstar you want to be. That you are. And that we that color you a superstar. Well, but if you have the wrong colors, nobody's going to know you're <laughs> a superstar. Amen. So you Amen. Get swatch book. <laughs> awesome. Thank cool. you. You're welcome.